Good morning, BUHS. Today is March 4th, 2022. On Saturday, March 5th at 7.30 until Sunday, March 6th until 8 a.m., go check out the Circus Spectacular at the Latches Theater. The Circus Spectacular is a dazzling fundraising show, star guests from artists, circuses around the world. On Saturday, March 5th, 2022, the Sunglass Theater is presenting a wonderful play, Under the Night Sky. The performance will be starting at 11 a.m. and last an hour. Tickets cost $7.50 for people who have Medicaid cards and $9 for anyone else, which I think is a steal considering how great this show is going to be. Now let's head over to Sam and Chloe for our special. Guys, I'm Chloe and I'm with Sam. Today we have a seven game series of rock, paper, scissors. First four to win gets this lovely trophy from 2015 and a lot's on the line here. So let's get started. All right. All right. Rock, paper, Wait, nope, okay. nope. Let's go. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay, that's one zero. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay, one one. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Boom, okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay, two two. two. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay, ready? <laughs> this is the <laughs> final round. Okay, here we go. Let's go. Okay, I'm taking the win today. Back to the desk. The town of Brattleboro has dropped the mask mandate and New Hampshire schools like Keene High School and Hinsdale High School have stopped requiring students to wear masks. Now let's check the weather with Kobe. Here's a high of 32 with a low of 10, sunny out. Saturday we have a high of 42, a low of 31, and it's going to be cloudy. Uh, wait, no, this way. Sunday we have chance of rain with a high of 62, a low of 38, and on Monday it's going to be rainy again with a high of 45 and a low of 34. Uh, back to the desk. The Brattleboro Brewers Festival will be held on May 28th at the Vermont Agriculture Business Education Center. It goes from 12.30 to 4.30. On March 5th this weekend, the Winter's Farmer's Market will open again and it's a chance to try local food and buy art from local artisans. Now let's head over to hear what people's favorite songs are. So this is our special, asking people what their favorite song is. Um, my favorite song is Hours and Hours by Gordon Young. What's yours? Um, right now my favorite song is probably Old Silverado by Trap House Coda. Good morning. Alright, let's go out to the people then. So, Will, what is your favorite song right now? Um, what's in my mind? Thank you. Thank you. What are you? That's a good song. Just sing. Just sing. Remember, Aiden. Aiden. Really slow forward. It was put in some of the uh, America, uh, like the Robert Downey movie, to catch up to the Captain America. Yeah. It was right there. at the end of the first movie. Of that oh, yeah, we put it, we fit it in. And it's a very cool song, but it was made in 1960. Yeah. That's very cool. Yeah, it's in the song. It's not in the song. And I saw my first concert with the Rolling Stones. In 1969. Wow. So. That's crazy. <laughs> thank, <laughs> thank you. Okay. Thank you. What's your favorite song right now? <laughs> Alright, so my favorite song right now is Money So Big by Yeet. Word. Alright, so what is your favorite song at the moment? Just by Boogie with a hoodie and probably Dior. Period. Alright, so what's your favorite song right now? Right now my favorite song is Dior by Young Nace. Word. Alright, thank you for your time. Excuse me, so what is your favorite song at the moment? Uh, Goat by Ron Suno. Dang, that's Word. pretty fire. Yeah. All right, what's your favorite song right now? Um, <laughs> has to be Costa Rica. Word. That's fire. Who's All right, thank you for your time, bro. Yeah, hey, 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 Damn. Okay. Um, what's up? 
So, what's your favorite song, like, right now? Mmm. I gotta say Seven Summers by Morgan Wallen. Well, no, it, it's country, but, like, yeah, that's it's right. good. Oh! Oh, oh you're, you're so bad! bad. St. Patrick's Day is Thursday, March 17th. Make sure to check in at the Kennelry Pub in Ludlow to chow down on some fresh scrub-style grub. Feeling a little cabin fever? Got the midwinter blues? Come to the YMCA in Keene and get your groove on during this high-energy dance party. This family-friendly event is free to the YMCA members. For non-members, it's $10 per family. Let's dive into the topic jar. Alrighty, let's see. So I guess we're just going to be picking a thing to talk about, just to say. Let's see. Okay. If a theme song played every time you entered a room, what song would you choose? I know. What song would you choose? The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air song. That's a mm -hmm. good one. That's mm -hmm. what I would do. I agree. Let's see. Uh, I'd probably have the narwhal song, where it's like narwhal, narwhal, <laughs> swimming in an ocean. I think that'd be funny. The Pirates like of the it. Caribbean song. The Pirates what? of the Caribbean. Oh. Hmm. I think I'd probably say the Hey Mickey. I don't remember who's that by, but yeah, that one. Uh-huh. Oh. Yeah. That's a good question. Good question. Thank well, you, Topic Jar. That's a good topic for the jar. <clears throat> Spring sports are right around the corner, starting on the 21st of March. Don't forget to sign up on Power School and get all of your forms in to be eligible. Go Colonels. Now let's hear about the Paralympics with Levatus. Hi, this is Levatus with the sports news. Now, the Paralympics are on with two events tonight being women's sprint sitting, which is a Paralympic biathlon, and downhill standing, which is the men's Paralympic alpine skiing. In other news, Russia has been excluded from the Paralympics due to war crimes, and Belarus has been excluded for being associated in this war. That's all with the sports. Back to the desk. There is a charity for the Russian-Ukraine war supporting Ukraine. Head to care.org to help Ukraine. The BHS players are thrilled to announce auditions for the upcoming spring play. The internet is distract is the distract. Oh look, a kitten. A comedy by Ian McWealthy. This high octane comedy that explores the rabbit hole of dis of distraction we go down every time we go online. Auditions will be held on Wednesday, March 16th during ACE and 3.40 p.m. in the Senior Lounge. Students can attend both one or both auditions and do not need to prepare anything. Dress to move. For more on information, see Mr. Rose or Ms. Page. Friday, March 4th is the Gallery Walk and it's happening downtown Bradderboro from 5.30 to 8.30. Now let's watch a short film from Sam and Chloe. That's all, BUHS. Have a great weekend. Bye. Peace.